Little Bar Red Dog Games presents Rogue State. Shall be free. So this is a kind of empire management game. You play as the leader of Basenji. But we'll get more into this in the introduction. But just know our family name is Greenling. We're going to play a normal mode because we don't have any sen scenarios or hard mode unlocked yet. We're going live in three, two, one. Basenji News Hour. For those just joining us, we are fortunate to have an audience today with our glorious leader. Excellency, last week we experienced the conclusion of the trial of the tyrant King Solomon, with his execution scheduled for next Friday. With the Great Revolution finally concluded, what will the future political structure of the People's Republic of Bisenji finally look like? Well, Zara, King Solomon was a corrupt and sadistic man. Under his rule, our people served while he sold away our most sacred objects to pay for his own luxuries. Hundreds of thousands of souls died under his tyranny, yet he was tolerated by the American imperialists. His death will give us closure, but our work is only just beginning. The people's revolution is never really over. We must rebuild this country from the ashes, reform it. The Revolutionary Council has put me in charge of the transitional government for the next five years to maintain order while a new constitution is drafted. One that meets the needs of all the people. Many were expecting your brother Farouk would be named by the Revolutionary Council as the interim leader of Besenji. What role will he have in the transitional government? Farouk is popular to be certain and was a fellow patriot of the revolution. He will be given an appropriate role in my cabinet. It is often said that the Americans are suspicious of our transitional government and that you face a great deal of pressure from domestic interests seeking reforms. Our first priority is of course reconstruction. The American imperialists are of no concern at this time. Governance is not an easy task, but I assure the people that we will build a stronger Basenji together. Thank you again for your time, Excellency. It is a pleasure, Zara. So that gives an uh, introduction to Rogue State and all the powers that play. So we also got a brother, introduction to our brother Farouk. Farouk is a bastard. So in our portfolio, we can assign ministers. We got two patriots and a capitalist. We also have our brother Farouk Greenling. So Farouk pretty much wrecks havoc. So um, it's important. Relations is very important for a government. So, as defense minister, Farouk will drop our military loyalty by two a turn. As a foreign minister, he will poison relations with the Americans by negative one a turn. As intelligence minister, Farouk will make intelligence breakthrough 25% less likely, which doesn't sound too bad, but with an intelligence minister, breakthroughs are 50% more likely. As communications minister, Farouk will reduce her facts to approve ratings by negative 1% per turn. So I've chosen financial minister as the choice. Um, I guess I kind of skipped over it, but as glorious leader of the newly formed People's Republic of Ben Senji, you're elected to your office in the royal palace of the late Tyreek King. Outside, hundreds of workers dismantled the bloodstained barricade installed by the monarchists last year. Another painful reminder of all that was lost in the war. Key revolutionary figures across the spectrum of political ideologies. I apologize. Now, selflessly looking to be awarded with appointments in the inner circle of cabinet ministers. So, let us give Farouk. Again, outside relations are very important. So, we will assign everything but a defense minister. Not that the military is not important, just the least important. First time in the big chair, new arrivals to the people of Public of Ben Senji may benefit from the in-game manual located here. Excellency, my name is Tariq Badur. As Parliamentary Chief of Protocol, 
It is my duty to ensure that your instructions reach our parliamentarians. Well, thank you very much, Drook. I trust Drook. you have settled into your new office. May I offer some suggestions on our first steps to restoring order to Bajinji? I know the basics, but I'll let this guy go through him. He explains them quite well. Yes, please begin. Excellent. To start, there are two units of currency to be concerned. One is our treasury fund. Which is in the negative, because our brother Froke is stealing most of it. Of our which we're getting a small boost in because of our choices to begin. of cabinet ministers. The state infrastructure button. Okay, so we need to click on the state infrastructure button. So as soon as people are with water sewage, it's causing us treasury funds to restore it. When you're ready, click the restore sewage icon. So, restore watered sewage and ensure watered sewage is maintained in the majority of the country. 50% increase in tax revenue. Good. Now we need some assistance from the international community to build some of our infrastructures. Click on the foreign aid workers pocket. So, aid workers will arrive from non-government organization to help manage labor shortages, provide humanitarian support, and assist with reconstruction of critical buildings and infrastructure. So, some infrastructure purchases will require you to make immediate policy decisions. You only choose one of two policy options presented. Choose between prioritizing medical and engineering relief now. So, medical will give us a reduce in medical costs. Well, this will give us an improvement to medical, military approval and reconstruction limits reduced. So, kind of a toss up. We are already in the negative, but I think. We do not have very much military approval, so we're going to go with allow foreign aid workers engineering team. Engineers will move debris, stabilize structures, and restore roadways. This will speed up the time needed to reconstruct Bisenji's essential services, and will assist the military in moving resources in and out of the cities. So, good. Let's store power to our populace. Rebuild power infrastructure. Ensure electricity is restored in the majority of the country. 15 pence increase in tax revenue. Very good. You will see that none of our other state infrastructure developments can be unlocked this turn. So close window and look at other policies. So, okay, so there's glitching out earlier, but it's working now. Let's look at our policies. What policies do we have in force? Our economy is stagnant. Workers feel exploited. And it's just one of your first image path, a minimum wage. Nothing too extreme, or capitalists will protest. So labor is reduced, jobs are increased. So, low minimum wage. Next, let's open the door to private enterprise and permit trade-free zones. Time to sure to go our economy. Um, where's that? Free trade zone. While well, implemented geographic area is set aside for goods to be received, manufacturing, export outside Bisenji without application of customs dues. GP down, corruption. Excellent. Keep close eye on how much factory supporters are rising and falling each turn. If you find you are losing a factory support at the current time, alter SNG's public relations are a great way to gain their confidence. That's enough now. Close winner and let's take a look at our budget. But yeah, pretty much we have. Decrease in corruption, increase in jobs, and the GDP. So. But. Hmm. Voluntary prayer week leave. Decrease in the GDP. Ah, we have to leave that. So, no mass transit system. What's up? Hopefully, by traffic congestion. Does that cost us money? Yeah, it would cost quite a bit. So, we're gonna leave them. We are to look at our money down here. Tower foreign worker problem. Problems on the influence of special visas. So, what happens if we adjust that? Increase in jobs. But the capitalists don't really like that. Yeah. That's increase in jobs. Yeah, we'll do that. Gambling prohibition. Gambling is strictly prohibited. The fundamentalist over like that. What happens if we GDP goes up? 
but fundamentalists really don't like that. I can take a look at it. I'm prepared. No choice for funds are added to the disaster preparation pool. No, we're un totally unprepared. The old ways to state that all sh shall one day be judged by how they cared for others in need. Limited disability. Does not seem to affect anybody's prosecution budget. Good. Five minutes will need to argue the long, complicated, and uninteresting cases. Lawless country. Legal back. Our sufficient funds sort all kinds of cases. Most of with legal backlog. Union power is limited. But we're picked so. That will stick with union power is limited. Death penalty. Reduces crime. Oh, but the liberals don't like that. Whatever. School. Every my members would like to be in high school. I'll never would leave these. Costs two million. Yeah, there's better things. Yeah, we're gonna stick with what we have then. What's this? Homeless shelters. Support and crime is reduced. I will make homeless shelters. Closer to despise citizens and deter them. Reduction in crime. The liberals hate that though. Yeah, we're gonna stick with that. Click on the treasury button. Okay, so what's at the treasury button? It'll tell us how much money we're losing. Raise tax will lower your approval, but it may be necessary in the short term. So let's raise tax to 50%, if not just for now. That was a good choice. We can export our gorge up because our industries are still in a state of disappear after resolution. Later, from an export economy, ensuring you have the best possible price when trading with neighbors will be essential. For now, let's close the window and look at some else. I'm asking to increase it just so we can be at a staple. Because otherwise. Oops, I don't want 17. Otherwise, we're. <laughs> I don't want to be hemorrhaging money. That just looks bad. So. Most actions in the game cost time points. There are four time points in a turn. The number of time points available can be seen on the clock in the bottom right hand corner of the screen. When all four time points are consumed, a turn ends and an event occurs. Events are rarely good news. <laughs> Most actions, including building infrastructure, changing policies, calling neighbors, and moving military units, will cost time points. When our industries are restored in the state infrastructure menu, Bajinji will receive two resources. Those resources will appear here, in the resource menu. Okay. I suggest exporting goods that other countries will pay well for, and importing goods necessary to create manufacturing bonuses. Manufacturing bonuses are rewards conferred for having certain combinations of goods in your country, either produced domestically or imported from neighbors. Click on the resource menu that was just highlighted to see all the possible manufacturing bonuses. Okay, so oil. Okay. Close the radio. Let me show you some some media. Doubles the effect of <laughs> sweatshops. <laughs> no ongoing expenses for shop swaps. Liberal approval. Trendy cashmere manufacturing. Traditional cuisine, fast food, three capitalists, one fundamentalist, religious podcasts, smartphone manufacturing, and automotive manufacturing. All interesting. Keep your friends close and your enemies closer. The people love Farouk, so you need to keep him in your regime. But we should keep a close eye on the loyalty of your parliamentarians. When faction approval drops, when your cabinet members get displeased, or when we start to lose wars or run out of funds, that's when our parliamentarians' loyalties shift. Their loyalty is represented with loyalty points, that other currency. If you start seeing loyalty points drop, then something is seriously wrong with Pajinji. 
If loyalty falls too low, Farouk may attempt to push us out of power. For now, let's take a closer look at the parliament window. Why don't we just kill Farouk? Yeah, I think that would be our best. Best bet, but I guess you can't do that. Americans would do it. Try to fulfill the quest catamounts whenever possible and keep the people happy. Sure, percentage is safe and stable. We have nothing to worry about. Pretty close window. We are gaining two every turn. We got approval. <laughs> Zero percent approval from our brother. Part of the gold people may endure for 10,000 years. So this bank loyalty points. Okay. Except skill keep besides part of the half is gonna earn in excess of a hundred starting the bank can be deemed for extra influence over Bethany's affairs. Interesting. I'll leave you to it now, Excellency. This is not everything there is to see and do, but with luck you will figure out the rest yourself. You can always hit the buzzer if you are in need of a more fulsome report of the health of our beloved country. For now, I suggest advancing to the next turn sooner by clicking on the clock. Well, there's probably more stuff we could do. In your leadership, Excellency. Okay, well, I will continue to slurp the wall. Well, and then I'll go pick up the phone. Because it will be something interesting, I am sure. Greetings, Your Excellency. I am Prime Minister Fatima al Farsi. And on behalf of Babelistan, I wanted to be the first to welcome the liberation of the People's Republic of Basenji from the tyranny of the Salman family. The Salman regime was a threat to the whole region. That is why we provided your rebellion with the weaponry and training necessary to overthrow the tyrants. Once the transitional government has restored Basenji's infrastructure and industry, let us work towards restoring our trade relationship. Do not hesitate to contact me if there is any way Babelistan can be of assistance to you. Thank you for your call. I am certain our two great nations will work together to bring great prosperity to the region. There is much work to be done, but I am grateful for your country's support. Um, let's discuss issues. Um... We're interested in jointly funding with the Nets. Hmm. We are interested in jointly funding with the United States development projects in your country. Babelistan is not in need of your assistance, but thank you for thinking of us. While we may glorify the old ways, we must not fall victim to the trap of institutionalizing it into the state. We agree. Persecution is not an original feature in any religion, but it is always the feature of all religions established in the laws of the state. Okay. Thank you for your insight. Apologies, but I must go. Let us speak again later. Goodbye. So, so that was interesting. I think we're gonna head and see if we can look at more of these things. So let us go and look at the regional map. Ooh. So. Is this us? I'm guessing this is us. So we have Babelistan, Zarbil, and Trajakistan around us. That's good information to know. Let's pick up the newspaper and give it a read. Um, nothing too interesting there. Okay, well that's cool. Kind of gives you an advantage. Let's check out the situation room, just so we have an idea of what's happening over there. Ooh, let's talk to General Nader Adad. 
kind of a pain in the butt that we have to walk these places every time, though. Oh, do you have any orders, Excellency? Military morale. How is morale within our armed forces? The armed forces are satisfied with your leadership. They know you are doing your best. How about strategic assessment of Tajikistan? I am considering deploying our forces into Trashikistan. What are the risks? We have insufficient intelligence on the exact number and deployment on the Trashikistan military. Without better information, any attack against them will carry a significant risk. Ooh. So. So we got intel. They don't really know much about. <laughs> doesn't seem like we know much about any of these places. Ooh. 33%. Well, thank you. I think we just looked at. What's the procurement officer? Take a look at that. Fifth. Okay. Infantry, tank brigade, rock battery, fire squadron. Yeah. So I don't think we need to buy anything for the army right now. Clandestine operations. Space program, hydroelectric dam. And that's the cost of part of the other wizard. <laughs> Interesting. Massive intro to devastation. Okay. Giant firewall. Sasper not possible. Hmm. Quite interesting. But let's head to the office. Actually, there was stuff I missed there, I think. Need a complimented nuclear weapon okay so that we just missed a nuclear weapon thing that we don't even have so perfect hmm so we can't build any more infrastructure so can you find money from the National Treasury into your offshore bank? I'll probably charge 20% commission for money laundering. Money can be thrown on discount, move to treasure daytime. Having a large balance account of endgame will increase your final score. Any new XP that will unlock additional gameplay modes. Well, don't think I want to do that right now. So yeah, I think we will just end the turn. Ooh, where else do you have a gain? Where do we get a gain from? of alcohol so who's a fan of alcohol the liberals so possession permitted okay well that's fine but let's go with the consumption ban So our support systems are pretty poor, so we can spend some money on that. Deliverous like that. GDP. I'm more interested in making the Patriots happen with me. Labor rights. Crime. 
jobs. Stagnant economy. With modest standards, I think that's probably a good bet. Um, hmm. I think we're better off. What did we put? Oh, okay, three billion is just a little bit more. But what we could do. Ooh, that ended the day. So we're at negative one turn. Well, I guess that's fine. American predator drone has attacked a fundamental church in Tajikistan. Drone does not appear to have ever passed over Basenji airspace. We have seen no warrant of attack, and no one wants that their target had any strategic value. Um. We will not do anything. <laughs> so. Okay, well, they're it's increasingly identified as fundamentalists. So let us look at our infrastructure. Yeah. Definitely want to restore financial structures. Because... They'll increase our tax revenue. They use funds from the Treasury to honor war bonds. Banks will start to grant microfinance leads to entrepreneurs. Television, radio, and internet will be brought under state control and made available to the majority of the country. We'll do that. For sure. So that used up some of our time. Um. I don't think there's too much else. Let's make a f call to... Babelistan. Oh, how do I say call her? I don't get how it works. Oh, there you go. Thank you for taking my call. Discuss straight. We'd like to deepen the long-standing cooperation that exists between our two nations. We would like to deepen the long-standing cooperation that exists between our two nations. We enjoy our privileged relationship and look forward to accomplishing great things together. Um. We are very worried about Western imperialism. Yes. We should continue to take strong measures to assert our right to exist free from foreign interference. It is our responsibility to govern in the strictest traditions of the old ways and to protect the people from heretical philosophies. This theological closed-mindedness is what is truly eroding the moral fiber of Basenji. <laughs> I didn't ask you to read what Apologies, this is about. But I must Goodbye. Might have lowered our relationship. But I just like clicking on stuff and seeing what happens. It's fun. Um, so we're actually in a positive. Don't think that really helped. Let's phone the King of Zarbel. Thank you for taking my call. Um. No. We <laughs> want to work with you to advance human rights and freedoms in the region. Hmm. It is interesting to hear you say this. The people enjoy many freedoms here in Zarbil. Can you truly say the same about Basanji? Um... I really believe in the United Nations. 
While we may glorify the old ways, we must not fall victim to the trap of institutionalizing it into the state. Those who say religion has nothing to do with politics do not know what religion is. Hmm. Let's see what we they say about this. The United Nations is essential to preventing conflicts in our region. We are wary of the ways the Western powers behave in their security council. Yeah. Apology. Goodbye. I didn't agree with the United Nations either. Um. I want to look at the parliamentary cabinet because I don't know if that costs anything for time. <laughs> Wish I could fire Farouk. He's such a pain in the butt. Public approval is increasing by two. I pretty much everybody is supportive. So. Um. I don't think taking the newspaper uses much time. American Strike Church! Weather for class, Patriot. So, yeah. Seven million a turn now. What? Oh, maybe because of our infrastructure? Let's look at some policies then. I would like to make peak hours to help relieve a traffic congestion. And I would also like to increase our school function. Um, GDP. Don't really want to piss off the fundamentalists. But. Yeah. The government provides suitable homeless shelters for the majority of our populations. And. What does this do? Increases powerful labor, but decreases jobs. Now we're gonna leave it where it is. Yeah, where I like increasing jobs. So I think we've made a change there. Gun ownership is highly restricted in percentage. Local organization is petitioning the government to relax those measures. There's significant money made in legalizing and tax these transactions. The liberals will dislike it. Everybody else likes it. So we were going to go with that. Yeah, the liberals don't approve, but everybody else is pretty happy with my legislation. So let's improve our infrastructure. Restore state industries. Sanjay's manufacturing sector will be staffed with capable revolutionaries taxed with the return pre operated levels. Perfect. Restore just system. The senior commanders of the former king's armies will, will trial for the war crimes committed against the people of Bessanji. This reflects the end of the introductory period. So, do we want restore? Prison monarchs? No, we're going to prison. War is over and the people are worried of seeing their fellow citizens incarcerated simply for following the king's order. However, the solution keeps monarchs from following your cap members with seditious thoughts. Hmm. No, we're imprisoning them. With the justice is in place, the wounds of the revolution can finally start to heal. Guys, now that's the new three state infrastructure policy purchase categories. Security, society, and trade. The cooperation with like minded states locks new countries' kind of business options in the foreign relations menu. Nations through trade and prosperity locks new countries. Okay. Hmm. Three million turned from tourism. What's that five?
was verse engineering. This is some like good thing to do. This will cost five circles. I'm not sure exactly how that works. First, we'll receive one massive one time boost. Bugged rooms, increased intelligence collection. Minutes will spare no interact the rich and famous. We're gonna go with five tele star service. Don't think we can really afford anything else. Corriffy support. Increased healthcare costs, that's so good. We're just schools permanently unavailable. If I'm at paper, plus one million, we're gonna go with that. Capitalists approve, and we're making another million per turn. At least I thought we should be making. Why are we losing so much money? Healthcare. Policy six infrastructure cost five million. Two is the other. Don't know why we're I don't think we should be losing money, but we'll see. Um Let's talk with Margaret Hamilton. Good day, Ambassador. Would you be free to meet sometime in the next few weeks? It is always a pleasure, Your Excellency. I would be happy to meet with you when an She's opportunity a southern. opens in our busy schedule. Well, we gave it a shot. Sir and Billy doesn't like us. Probably because of some of the comments we made. Thank you for taking... Um, hmm. Shoot, I actually don't know. I think this wasted my turn, but I didn't remember what we had. Excellent, the World Bank is offering President a new inch loan of 200 for the fines with terms of 7 million per turn for the next 5 years. Set this loan with short term. Hmm. We will refuse the loan. Who's this? Is this the American? We did. She accepted our phone call and she came by. Thank you for seeing me, Ambassador. It is my pleasure. Basenji's political situation is dire. I beg of you. Please help me regain the support of my people. It's disappointing that you can't maintain control of your own country. Very well. I'll write an editorial in the newspaper in support of your so-called leadership. Okay, that's bad. Um, it showed... <laughs> Tell me, Ambassador. Do you have any insights regarding some of the other countries in the region? Well, I did hear some gossip from the ambassador of New Zealand the other day. Tell me, how are you enjoying our country? This is my third post into the region, and my family is very happy here. I am pleased. If there is anything we can do to make things more comfortable for you, please do call upon us. And I believe that is all I have to say for the moment. Very well. Thank you for your hospitality. I hope we can chat again soon. Yeah, so I think that kind of made us look bad, but she is going to write a newspaper for us. So, okay, so if we get the sheeps, yeah. Well, that's just double sweatshop. We have spices. We need microchips and spices. Hmm. 
<laughs> so yeah, we need that watery thing. That'd be good. But when exported, when imported. Okay, so I could try to try to offer her some media exports. Thank you. Discuss trade. Are you interested in negotiating a trade agreement where we sell you Basenji media and entertainment? Certainly. These are the terms we are prepared to agree mm. on. Okay. Sure. Um, are you just Basenji garments? In negotiating a trade agreement where we sell you Basenji garments? Certainly. These are sure. We must work together to counter extremism both within and outside our borders. Many of these extremist groups are supported by the United States to contain our regime. Um. Don't need her goats or her spices right now. Hmm. Now, I think we're fine for now. Apologies, but I must go. Let's goodbye. So that should increase our gain. Other than that, everybody kind of pretty much likes us. So, let's look at how this works again. We get spices and microchips. Spices, microchips. Yeah, no, I think we're fine for now. Hmm. So I don't really know what. Oh wait, it does say. Plus one and plus two a turn. Hmm. Well we could talk to the leader of Tradikistan. So you just say thank you for taking We are very. We enjoy a positive and productive relationship with both the United. We want to. We agree on this. Failing to recognize these pressures. While we may glorify those who say religion has nothing to. Okay, so. <laughs> I don't think that helped our relationship with that guy. Yes, it also hurt it. Man, we're not very good at talking on the phone. Generally, makes people not like us. But let's end the turn and see what happens. For our advice to the late king and ex in Zarbal, he appears to be in possession of some of our state secrets and compose the threat to success of our special projects. There's nothing we can do. Interesting. We can build more infrastructure now. Now we're making 30 million per turn, which is pretty good. Don't we need the approval? Hmm. Okay, so if I get that, we'll be able to get 15.
that's fine. Yeah. Let's just end the turn and see what happens. The Synergy Intelligence Authorities obtained credible evidence that anti Western terrorists have set up training camps in the borders of Basenji. Of the financial aids and armaments. Does this seem good? So that increased our reputation with the, the Patriots and the Americans. This hurts it with the financial aids, increase it with the states and the Patriots. Well, I don't want to hurt my things with the fundamentalists, so we'll stick with that. Perfect. And we'll end it, just because I'm curious what's going to happen. But until the reach and the anti-terrorists looking has started a video tape upon Colin to rise up against your dictatorship. Hmm, terrorist revenues decline. There's some cause of death without label M2H1 poured in the Himalayan this week. Fire manifests only two types. Chris Health are funding the fully managed by this disease. Yep. That's fine. And just curious. My players of Bacenji Nest took the field at the World Cup qualifying match where injured modifies free Bacenji's political prisoners. They are poured but are to the release of thousands of marks imposed by the revolution. This act of post is becoming a popular topic of approval across the country. Um Ignore this protest. But anyway guys, I think you guys got an idea of what Rogue State is like. So I think we'll call this an episode here. And we'll be back for another series in the next one. Thanks guys. Later.